Thank you for watching a candlestick trading video. Some Japanese candlestick patterns. The Japanese have been using a candlestick chart for trading since the 17th century to analyze rice prices. Candlestick were introduced into modern technical trading. Candlesticks contain the same data as a normal bar chart but highlight the relationship between opening and closing prices. The narrow stick represents the range of prices traded during the period high to low, while the broad midsection represents the opening and closing prices for the period. If the close is higher than the open, the candlestick midsection is hollow or sh shaded. Uh, blue green. Uh, if the open is higher than the close, the candlestick midsection is filled in or shaded red. The long white line is a sign that buyers are firmly in control. A bullish candlestick along black line shows that sellers are in control. A bearish pattern marbles are even stronger. Bull or bear sig signals down long lines as they show that buyers sellers have remained in control from the open to the close. The doji candlestick occurs when the open and the closing price are equal. This indicates the instability of the market and the uh, exhaustion of the traders. An open and close in the middle of the candlestick signal indecision, long ledged dojis when they occur after small candlestick indicate surge in volatility and one of a potential trend change. Uh, four price dojis where the high and low are equal are normally only seen on thinly traded stocks. The dragon fly occurs when the up and the close are near the top of the candlestick and the signals reversal after a downtrend. The hammer is not as strong as the dragonfly candlestick, but also signals a reversal after a downtrend. The shadow of the candlestick should be at least twice the height of the body. A gravestone is identified by open and close near the bottom of the trading range. The candlestick is the converse of a hammer and signal reversal when it occurs after an uptrend. Thank you.